Hi everyone, my name is Dr. Kate Bieberdorf, but you may know me as Kate the Chemist. I'm the author of The Big Book of Experiments and Dragons vs. Unicorns, and this weekend I challenge you to do an at-home science experiment called the Lava Lamp. So, what you need is a plastic bottle. I usually use a one liter soda bottle for this. You're gonna need about two cups of water and then some food coloring and two cups of oil. It doesn't really matter what kind of oil you use. I like to keep a cap on mine so I can use my lava lamp over and over again. And then you're going to need some Alka-Seltzer tablets or effervescent tablets and antacid, basically. Okay, so step one. Take your plastic bottle, add your water to it. Then you're gonna add your food coloring. I like to use blues and greens, the darker colors, because I think it makes a better lava lamp. After that, you're gonna add your oil, and then the fun part, you crush up your antacids, and then you're gonna add it directly to the top of your lava lamp. Seal your cap and watch your lava lamp eruption. It's awesome. But the science challenge does not end there. Being a good scientist, you have to look at observations. You have to decide what's going on. So figure out what chemical reactions are happening inside of your lava lamp. But then after that, make predictions. What would happen if you made your lava lamp instead of a glass jar or a mason jar or maybe something even bigger like a two or a three liter soda bottle? What would happen if you switched out your water for Sprite or tonic water? Um, so make some predictions, come up with some hypotheses and then test it out. I cannot wait to see your experiments and if you're looking for more fun things to do at home, check out the Big Book of Experiments where I have 25 experiments you can do with things that are probably in your pantry or your craft bin right now.